<laughs> sometimes you just know, right? Like sometimes you ain't even really got a front for the camera. You already know. All right, you guys, so let's get into it. So I am trying this out because literally somebody commented, I don't know if you subscribe to my channel or not, but I thank you in either way. In my must-haves for 2023, I talked about how last year I tried so many gels, like, and I still haven't found the gel that works for me. So someone commented, I'll pop it up in here, um, to try out this gel. And so um, she said it was on Amazon. And I went on Amazon and looked, I hadn't ordered it, but when I went to go re-up on my protein treatment, it was sitting right there in Sally's. So I'm gonna be trying the Maui Moisture Curl Quench Coconut Oil Ultra Hold Gel for thick curly hair. The uh, gel now, it is real, it's doing a lot of movement. Can you hear it? I'm just like, ooh. Well, we're gonna see. She said it has hold. And so I'm gonna try it out. Now, I, I have washed and deep conditioned my hair. Um, I did a moisturizing deep conditioner. And so I'm not, I'm gonna try not to use any other product. Um, I was looking down there at my leave-ins and all of my leave-ins are thick. And so I really just wanna try this gel by itself. So I've got some water. And I am going to re-wet these sections. All right, and I need my dimming brush. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna do a little bit of detangling. I did detangle in the shower, but I also don't have any product in my hair. All right. So I'm gonna do small sections just to give this gel its best chance. So I'm gonna go ahead and take an even smaller section. I really want this to work. Let me just start that off by saying that. Okay. Okay, so it's moving, it's doing a whole lot of movement in the jar, but it's it's thick. It's thick like eco-thick. So we're just gonna go ahead and apply it. It smells like coconut. It's very coconutty. Um and I think I might need some more. Okay. Okay. You know, if y'all have watched my channel, y'all know I'd be looking for my hair to be stuck. And mm, it's not as stuck <laughs> as Eco, but it is clumping my hair really well. And Yeah, it doesn't it doesn't feel thick enough off rip like it's thick but it's not like the thick that I'm used to but it clumped my curls really well they're on a on a scale from one to stuck they're at a smooth like six so yeah we're gonna we're gonna keep going the smell is pretty loud I wonder do they have they probably have I know I think my cousin uses the um, shampoo and conditioner from this line, so I'd have to see if maybe they have like a leave-in. Um, but yeah, I mean, again, it's it's not as thick as Eco, but it's thicker than a lot more like jellies that I've used before. Um, so we're gonna see. We're gonna see how it does for me not to have any product in my hair I am able to like rake it through pretty easily um, like it's smoothing down my hair it's not like you know ah, I don't know y'all I'm gonna get excited cuz I ain't gonna get it I ain't gonna get excited I'm not so yeah I'm gonna continue doing this uh, keeping my section size pretty small raking the gel down the length of my hair and i'll come back let y'all see what my head looks like 
once it is all in there and then I'm probably gonna let it air dry and I'll come back and diffuse it on camera for you guys so we can kind of get an idea today of what's gonna happen because if it ain't gonna look good I'm gonna have to redo my hair for the weekend okay I ain't gonna lie to y'all this gel feels really good like even in the application like I don't know if you guys know how some gels like even when you're trying to smooth them with a leave-in or another product in it's like they don't like smooth into your hair when you apply them this is going on so well but y'all know like for me it ain't really the application it really ain't the definition it's the whole and unfortunately that's not something you can tell until it dries and so you can get all excited if you want to i'm talking to myself during the styling process but if that whole say absolutely not then all of this was real cute but unless i want like a fluffy wash and go Hey, so <laughs> sometimes you just know right like sometimes you ain't even really got a front for the camera you already know if this dries with any level of hold this is it I'm telling y'all that right now I, I could tell I do my hair enough to be able to tell when my hair is responding well to a gel do y'all see this H hold on let me just y'all look at how defined my curls are and shining mm. shining they are shining um let me turn around let y'all see the back let me turn around let y'all see the back All right, y'all, so I am gonna let this air dry for probably about an hour and a half, two hours, and then I'm gonna come back and diffuse it, and we're gonna see how it looks, how it feels. This smells, as I was putting it in, I was like, what does this smell like? This literally smells, and this is gonna be very specific, but go with me. A pina colada and blueberry frozen, like from the man on the corner. Not the man on the corner, but you know the dude that makes frozens or ices out the truck, like with the pump syrups that's what this smells like that's what it smells like it smells really good i love this going into summer well i mean it's the end of february but summer's coming and i feel like this is going to be a really good summer product but if this thing holds my hair y'all i'm year round i'm just i'll be back in a little while to diffuse it and let y'all know my final thoughts So, I have pretty much diffused, mm, I would probably say 90% dry. Oh no, I got a little bit still up in here. Up in the root, it's still kind of wet, but like my ends are dry and I think this is gonna hold y'all. I really actually like it. Like I really like it. I don't have, for me not to have any other product in my hair, like, the fact that my curls are this defined and shiny and soft, still zooming in. Mm. They're so soft, like, I'm excited. Yeah, I am going to um, go ahead and I may diffuse it a little bit more off camera but I'm going to probably put it in a pineapple. Oh yeah, this is still wet. I got some more diffusing to do, but for the most part, like on the ends it's dry, like 
down here it's dry it's just my roots that still need some work but um i am going to go ahead and pineapple after i finish getting my roots dry and then i'm going to let it grow tomorrow and i'll probably come back on friday just the day after tomorrow to let you guys see what it looks like and that'll be day two here or maybe i'll do day one and day two here we'll see either way i'll see y'all in the next clip all right you guys this is my day one hair i wanted to come really quickly and show you now i know i had a middle part but i think it looks better with the side part um my hair is so defined i do have hold but it's not hard crunchy if that makes sense it's a good firm hold but it's not that hard like crunch to my head so I love it. I'm going to come on tomorrow and let you guys see it as well. But I did want to let y'all see day one hair, what it's looking like. Um, I think this gel is the new, I think it's the new one. I really do. So I'll see y'all in the next clip, which will be tomorrow. All right, you guys. So this is my day two hair. I knew it. I told y'all. You do your hair enough, you know it. Y'all, I love this gel. I love it. It has such a good hold. My hair is extremely defined, like, and it's held, y'all. Like, I can feel the hold. It's not, like, crunchy in the sense where it's going to, like, really, it's, like, really hard and really dry. It's a hold, but it's not, like, this drying hold, especially when I don't have anything else in my hair. So, I really feel like, I really feel like I have found the replacement for the Eco Styler Gel. Sis, thank you, girl. I'm going to let you guys see the back. Alright y'all, so now that you know I absolutely love the gel, let's get into the specifics of the gel itself. Um, it says it is specifically for thick, curly hair. Um, it says, for the directions, apply desired amount to palms and work through damp or dry hair, scrunch, and then air dry or use a diffuser. Once dry, scrunch again to soften curls. Use only as directed, all the warnings, all those good things. The first ingredient is aloe leaf juice and it says made with 100% aloe vera as the first ingredient define moisturize and revive so like i said i found this at sally's for 9.99 but i literally went i wish i had my phone with me it's in my amazon cart right now it's 7.99 on amazon and this is for 12 ounces and after using it yesterday uh i did make a pretty decent dent in it Ooh, not about to <laughs> not about to come out so i think you know for the amount and for the price and because it does my hair so well and because it's you know paraben free silicone free mineral oil free synthetic dye no gluten no sulfated surfactants surfactants here y'all can read it for yourself because what i'm not gonna do is try to pronounce that again um vegan hair care like i think for what it does and the type of product it is i'm willing to pay this for a gel like i've paid more for other products and gels are my thing they're the so necessary for me and my hair and i love that this doesn't limit my hair make it crunchy and hard and um limp like it still has body and all those good things so definitely 10 out of 10 for the maui curl quench coconut oil ultra hold gel love it i wish they had it in a bigger jar but i'm gonna go buy it again right now from amazon so yeah y'all that is the details specifically for this gel i can't wait to try it with the leave-in conditioner and some of my other products so if you like this video please give it a thumbs up if you have any questions or comments if you're gonna try this gel or you've tried it before why didn't you tell me about it but let me know in the comment section and if you're not subscribed to the ambient life please go ahead and hit that subscribe button and i will see y'all in my next video bye